Hey everybody, Coleman Alderson for GardensAll.com. Now I'm out here with our makeshift, make-do greenhouse that we uh, put up some information on earlier. And this is basically right now like a coal frame. We did add a heater to it, but we need to do an upgrade. And the first thing we need to do is get this front section level. We are gardening on a hillside here. No problem with that really. It's really kind of cool having a hillside to garden on but setting a greenhouse in here, it really demands having a level structure if you can get it level. So what we've done is I've come in and set posts. These will be anchored in, in concrete, in the concrete block. What's holding the bottom of this thing, keeping it from spreading out, are these concrete blocks, these 12 inch blocks. The, um, I, I took a uh, measurement and then a level and determined that probably the best thing to do to level this is to raise this up and set it in a channel that I made out of two two by fours running about 75 inches. Now the trick's going to be when we pull this up making sure it isn't pivoting on that back end so we may have to do some field adjustments even move a post forward so it isn't rocking back and forth. But uh, this is the, the initial goal, and then we'll come back once we get it leveled up in the front, which should add about 20 inches. Uh, so we'll have 20 inches 20 more inches head of clearance. Height. Yeah. Head, cool. head clearance right here, and uh, that'll be great. Meanwhile, we'll uh, be coming in here, and you can have a peek. We're coming in here, and we'll strip these longer branches of the longevity spinach, take the leaves off, put them into dried form, either as a tea or as some sort of powder. And maybe it's good as a, just uh, sprinkling on a salad as well. But that's our goal for today is to get this leveled up and then we'll come back with a front kind of entry section and then a back section with a window. But we have to do this first and we'll keep you all apprised as we progress along. Coleman Alderson for GardensAll.com. So long.